I'm supposed to report to research. Let's get on with it. His time is running out. As you can see, our brother here is in the advanced stages of regression to his original Theron form. In a few minutes, his regression will be complete. Or would have been. What we propose to show you is a process by which we can extend these human bodies indefinitely. Just do it. As you can see, we have perfected an alternative regeneration process. A five-minute induction will extend the human form a minimum of six months. An additional five repetitions are possible before the breakdown of DNA becomes irreparable. That gives us an additional three years. More than enough time to reach the next stage. When will they be ready for distribution? For the moment, this is the sole prototype. We use it to make copies. This is a remarkable breakthrough. You will be rewarded. Who the hell are you? I could ask the same thing. Who the hell are you? I'll take that. Give it back! This is mine! I don't think so! certain it left the building. There's no trace of it. There's evidence of someone tampering with the security systems, and also tampering with one of the skylights in the lab. It was a Theron. No one else could have accessed the computer and erased our data like that. But one of our people wouldn't have used such a primitive means of entry as cutting the glass. Two intrusions. So we have a mystery. Mr. Dent is investigating and will arrive momentarily. Apprise him of every detail. 
We don't need that thing. We can handle this ourselves. May I remind you, Brand, that I have been here longer than any of us, and my body might revert at any moment. I understand. That thing, as you call him, is the only one I trust to retrieve the device. You trust it more than you trust your own people. We've been loyal to your cause. Loyalty is wrapped up in emotion, Brandt. Like love, desire and jealousy. Those emotions grow out of control through our obligatory dealings with the humans. They're dangerous. They divert us from our goal. Mr. Dent has none of these. And you? You've managed to remain separate from human emotion. Of course not, Brandt. As a matter of fact, when I viewed your device in action, I was filled with hope. And now? You don't want to know. Be thankful you're still alive. from the skylight. Very well equipped. Knew exactly what she was doing. We have to find her. She's not the problem. Manning will just manufacture more. Well, he can't. I wiped out his database. That prototype is the only existing blueprint now. Well, that simplifies things. So we do have to find her before Manning does. I'll find her. So come to think of it, human females can be very exciting. Careful, man, you're on a slippery slope. Well, she was beautiful, fearless, strong, and dangerous. I think we have lots in common. I found the intruder's blood. Once we decode the DNA, we can reconstruct the morphology. Good. Let's find out who they are. fingerprints. The rest should be easy. And the second intruder? Theron. He disabled the guard downstairs and left no trace in the computer room. Ethaniel. Or the other. Tolerance. Find the girl. Go. Mr. Dent. It's imperative to my survival. I'll find it. There's something about you and your demeanor. Something different. That would be fear, Dent. Of course. I recognize it now. Yes. I'll retrieve the device. If this thing is uh, as good as you say it is, it could make our year. You know that. Uh, Brady, no drinking. Not until we move this. When are you getting a, a 
all serious for, huh? A little drink is not going to hurt you. If the people I stole this from find us, your little drop will kill you. Remember that. Better be right about this, Mira. Because I'm going to look pretty stupid if it turns out to be junk. Believe me, if you find the right buyer, we can retire. Nathaniel, I was a part of Benning's organization. I know how they work. If they have anything at all, they'll have a face, a prince, everything. Whoa, there we go. What? Unauthorized entry into the law enforcement database downtown. Okay, can you tie into it? No, I'm not right now. Oh, now there's a mugshot. Okay, that's her. Grab it. Pleasure. Mira West, age 24. Reckless driving. That's it? That's enough. Can you get an address? 18 Flagstaff Road. That's not far. Warehouses, lofts. Benning's got the information also. We have to get there before he does. Uh, Biter, um, why don't you see if we can get something more on her? You know, we might need it if the address doesn't check out. All right. We go out after killer freak aliens, and it's all Biter. We need you in the field. But Catwoman shows up, and it's, uh, why don't you hang back and find her shoe size? I want to renegotiate my contract. Open up. We have to talk. You're in danger. How do you know my name? I came to get back the device you stole. Get lost. Listen to me. You don't know the people that you stole it from. You have to trust us. Next time, I am higher. to me. What you took is more important than you realize. I found you, so can they. Let's go. They'll kill you to get it back. And how do you know all this? It doesn't matter. Where is it? Well, that's a company secret. Hurry up! Nathaniel! They're coming. I think they're using the fire escape. Start the car. Wait for me downstairs. Hey, Slip, hold it. Put the piece down. Why don't you just leave me alone? Hey, we're just trying to save your life here. It could be a little bit friendlier. Doors! Meet us downstairs! You could get lost! Hey! Down! You see, those are the bad guys. I am the good guy. Bad guys, good guy. You brought them here! I didn't know Therans can fly.
Look, you can keep me here as long as you like. I've got nothing to say. Mira, I know this is going to be hard to believe, but the man you saw being cured wasn't human. You're crazy. The bunch of you. Look, this is about business. If you want that device back, why don't you make me an offer? If you think we're going to pay you, you're crazy. One way or another, you're going to tell us where it is. Oh, yeah? And what are you going to do? Torture me? I'm thinking about it. Look, you big goon, you're lucky I didn't burn your face off when I had the chance. You know what? I should have left you back there at your apartment with Banning. All right, so you saved me from the big bad Banning. Thank you. Happy? Now get the hell out of my life. Hey. Leave me alone. Do that, it's mine. A key. North Mount Mall. Maybe a locker? Let's go. Hey. I'll watch you. Who's gonna watch you? Do you, uh, like the bikes? Kind of gives the place some uh, atmosphere, you know? Nice environment to do business. Screw the atmosphere, Brady. Let's get to the point. Mm -hmm. Tell me about this thing you're selling. It's developed by Signum Laboratories. You know? Top secret hush-hush. What does it do? It heals people. Like, uh, instantaneously, just like that. Thing like that, you know, barely has a price, but, uh... For you, I think we can work something out. I want to see it. Good. Good, I'll, uh, set it up. So we meet back here, uh, in about an hour. One hour. soldier I've ever known. So you don't have to worry about him. I'm not worried about the soldier. See the way he was looking at it? He can handle it. It's dangerous. He doesn't fully understand human emotions, and she understands them all too well. Well, she is attractive. Oh, um... You like her, too? No, oh, I didn't say that. Right. I'm not attracted to her. You know, in that way. If that's what you mean. You know, it's against the law to hold me here against my will. I could have you arrested. <laughs> All strength start coming from a thief. Uh, you got any ice? What do you want ice for? Never mind. Here. <clears throat> I hate to drink alone. Oh, what was that? You know, there's something very odd about you. Odd but cute. You know what? You're not like other women. Now, there's an original line. Well, I mean, you make me feel different than other women. Maybe I'm a different kind of woman. Why do you do what you do, still? It's what I do. It's what I've always done since I was a kid. It's either that or accept whatever they want to turn me into in all those foster homes. The only difference is then I stole small. Now I still beg. That gadget was supposed to be the biggest. And the most dangerous. They would want it back. And they will kill you for it. And just let them try. Well, I won't let them. There are these people who aren't really people who want to kill me to try to get their machine back. 
What about you? How do you fit into all this? <laughs> well, it's my job to stop them. Sounds mysterious. That's all I can tell you. Mysterious is good. Did I do that? Yep. Cut me by surprise. It's not too bad. You know, the way you moved that day was incredible. On the roof and in the lab. You're faster and stronger than any man I've ever seen. <laughs> Now there's an original line. I'm serious. You picked me up like I was a feather. You jumped down that chimney, it must have been 60 feet. And caught me like a baby. It's not normal. Well, I keep trying to tell you that. You stumble into something bigger than you can imagine. This is crazy. You, that machine, all these people coming after me. I thought my life was crazy, but this... What are you, the bionic man? What? Never mind. She was, uh, she was supposed to call. Look, I, uh, I can have it for you tomorrow. Why not next week? Next month? Next year? I thought you were serious. You're just wasting my time. Look, this thing is one in a million. Okay, believe me, when you see it, you'll understand. It's too late. You've wasted my time. And that is unforgivable. keys from us simple she's setting us up you know i meant what i said before we'd make a hell of a team first thing first hmm? i gotta get that That's impossible. Are you sure you checked the right box? There has to be a reason. 
Mira. This is the second time she's gotten away from you. I dropped my guard. I was distracted. I don't know why. There's no denying she's sharp. Yeah, she does have an effect on you, Torrance. I've noticed that. Well, she's very interesting. Well, that's true. Women are the more interesting sex. Anatomically speaking, of course. Did you sleep with her? We didn't sleep. How could you do that? How could he not? She was fantastic. Can't even describe how I felt. <laughs> bye bye, Torrance. You're a goner. I can understand your fascination with all this, but you have a job to do. You can't let this get in the way of that. It's not going to get in the way. I found her once, I can find her again. She's probably not going to go back home. Probably not, but I know where she will go. They came after me. Listen, this thing is trouble. We gotta unload it fast. Tell me about it. I had a run in with them too. Are you alright? Yeah, I'm alright. We gotta be careful though. Do you have it? It's still stashed. Feeney dumped out when you didn't show. But I think I have someone else. They'll pay plenty, but you better not screw up this time. Don't worry, I'm not about to screw this one up. This is a big one. I know. Bring it here. He wants to see it work. I'll set up the meeting. No. The mall. 10 o'clock. Meet me at the usual spot. Okay. But you better be there, Mira. You just worry about your end of things. Hmm. Pretty smooth, Torrance. Okay, Brady. Where's the usual spot? What the hell are you? That's for me to know. What are you gonna do to me? <laughs> Probably kill you. Unless you tell me what I need to know. Outside the mall entrance, in front of the lobby. You better be right. You put a transmitter on it? Because I like her doesn't mean I trust her. You're close. Wherever she is, she hasn't moved in the last hour. Why would she stop here? Good question. Unless something's happened to her. Benny. It's just a matter of time. Okay. Just up ahead. Sure the signal's coming from here? Yep. She found it. She could be miles from here by now. At least we know where she's been. Okay, Mira. 
supply move. Can we find out where she called? Yeah, Biter might be able to track it. What? I need you to write down this phone number. 555-0311. See if you can crack the phone company and find out what calls were placed here within the last hour. Oh, crack into the phone company. Is that all, sir? Can you do it or not? Yeah, I can do it. People like to consider this confidential information, though. It could take a while. We don't have a while. Listen to me, Biter. Her life is in danger. If Banny gets to her before we do, I swear you're going to have to answer to me. You understand that? I'm on it. Thanks for calling. What's that about? I just don't want her to get hurt. That's all. None of us want her to get hurt. Let's go and find out. Thanks, Biter. I've got the location in front of me. We're on our way. She's called a guy named Arthur Brady. Officially a motorcycle mechanic, but he has a history. Mostly dealing with stolen merchandise. It must be a fence. Then she probably set up a meeting. But with whom? It's hard to say. Probably not a lot of people in the market for something like that. I'm sure Benning put out feelers. Brady's place isn't far. Can't we go any faster? Mount Mall in the lobby. You have to hurry. He's gonna kill her. Go! Um, you gonna be okay? Yeah. Go! Waiting for you. Where you been? I've been here where I said I'd be. Never mind. Just bring the gizmo. Of course I've got it. Where? Let me see it. It's inside. Here, come on. Get your hands off of me. All right. I'm sorry. Now come on. He's waiting. Let's see it. Just give me the device.
for it. Make me an offer. You're crazy. As long as you have that thing, your life is in danger. I'll learn your moves. I'll learn your weaknesses. Soon I'll be superior to all humans. And Ethereans. Soon! Not yet. Make me an offer! I have to say, right now it's a buyer's market. Mira, it's the only way you're going to get out of here alive. Give me the bag. We've had about as much fun as we're gonna have here. Who has the bag? She does. The lady up there. He seems to be enjoying himself. <sighs> well, I guess I should have trusted you guys. Yeah, we don't blame you. There's no way you could have known. Maybe next time you'll concentrate on things like jewels, security bonds, stuff like that. Yeah, uh, we should hook up. I can get you some Federal Reserve passcodes if you want, or something. Bye, dear. Thanks, but I'm thinking of changing my line of work. I'm kind of tired of risking my neck. See you later, Biter. I'm so happy to meet you. Bye. Good luck. Well, she turned out to be a very sweet girl. I can understand why you're interested in her, Torrance. Oh, man. Time of my death is. Hey. Sweet girl, my ass. She took my watch. My too. She got my wallet. Mila! Get back here! Retrieved it. You retrieved it. You've brought me a piece of junk. That is not what I ordered you to do. If it is a piece of junk, it is because it was a piece of junk when they made it. I took the same beating it did, and I still function perfectly. That machine was a technological marvel. You are a battering ram in human clothing. <laughs> Perhaps. But no other machine can serve you like I do. Don't flatter yourself. I trade you for that regenerator in a second. Do you have any idea how important that was? Oh, stop sulking. You look like I've hurt your feelings or something. I do not have feelings. 
Is that so? I am far too efficient to have feelings. Efficient. Get out. sci-fi Farscape when chaos and disorder reign peace becomes a memory but there is one man who still remembers I know what it feels like to be robbed of a lifetime I lost 300 years so did I on April 2nd Gene Roddenberry's newest vision of the future is coming to sci-fi. With all new episodes, Kevin Sorbo. We raise the stakes. In Gene Roddenberry's Andromeda. Premieres this Friday at 8 on sci-fi. Experience the new issue of Sci-Fi Magazine. Indulge your senses with the 25 sexiest women of sci-fi. Go behind the scenes of Guillermo del Toro's Hellboy. And go one-on-one -on -one with the orcs of sci-fi's new reality series, Mad Mad House. Subscribe now and save almost 50% off the newsstand price. Call or log on and get six issues for $16.99.